in her business, surely she was, uh, I believe, uh, uh, and reporting situations where there was ethical breakdowns and cash But not to the board. And it, it got to the board level, it got to the corporate level in 2013 because progress was not being made and the board level in 14 as the corporate resources started to, and we've been actually seeing improvements since that time. It does not seem enough. like there was just in fairness, uh, again, a, a, there does seem like a big disconnect there. Um, so she left uh, after 27 years, and I, I think it would be good for the audience at some point, not during my time, to explain the, the entire compensation. I think it's a little different than, than most people think based on some of the comments that have been made. But I assume her departure after 27 years was based on this issue, is that correct? It was based on a number of issues. This is one of them. We want to take the business in a different direction. And we so also- So she, in essence, was terminated over this issue? Uh, no, Ch uh, Carrie chose to retire. Tim Sloan, our chief operating officer, it was my consultation, had a discussion with her. I think it was sometime in June or July and said, we want to go in a different direction we want to put an end, we want to put more focus on this issue, but it was a variety of things, and she was eligible for retirement, and she decided to retire. Hey, CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you're going to find videos packed with all of the information that you need to be smarter about your finances. You can subscribe by clicking right here, and click on all the videos around me or the eye right here to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.